Well, the countdown is on for the first day of school in Spokane. Time to check off everything on that back to school list, including the one thing every family needs to do before the first day. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Nadine Woodward. Spokane schools will once again crack down this year to make sure your child's health information is up to date. That includes making sure that they're either vaccinated or have the paperwork signed electing not to. During the mumps outbreak last spring, hundreds of kids had to stay home from school throughout the county because they weren't vaccinated. Even though parents signed forms saying they understood what could happen, many said they were shocked when it actually did. KXY 4's Kyle Simchuk working for you. Kyle, you checked in with some local health officials about the importance of getting those records up to date. Well, Nadine, doctors here at Spokane Regional Health are reminding parents just how important vaccines are, especially after what happened last school year. It was last winter, Spokane County schools were at war with the mumps virus. More than 330 cases were confirmed countywide, many of them school-aged children. Those students spent weeks away from class, and so did all unvaccinated students. That's because unvaccinated children have a higher chance of spreading the virus, and state law allows districts to keep kids out who haven't received those important shots. Spokane Regional health knows some parents question the safety of vaccines but doctors say there's nothing to worry about vaccines are one of the greatest public health uh, um, accomplishments you know, of this uh, this last century because we've we've conquered a lot of the really serious communicable diseases you know with the help of vaccines and they're they're a great tool the state of Washington does allow parents to opt out of vaccinating their children, but parents must fill out the appropriate forms before their children are allowed in school. If more than two cases of any infectious disease are reported during the school year, all unvaccinated children at that particular school will be required to stay home until the virus is no longer a threat. Now, coming up at 6, we'll tell you ways to get your child's vaccinations up to date for free. Reporting live in Spokane, Kyle Simchuk, KXLY 4 News. All right, thank you, Kyle.